A seating chart with an updated user interface and improved functionality is now available in Gradebook. On the seating chart screen in the roster drop-down list, select the class, class group, or homeroom for which you want to create a seating chart. If you have not created any seating charts for this roster on the new version, click Add a new chart or the plus icon to begin creating a new seating chart. The Create a Seating Chart area displays. In the Name field, enter the name for the seating chart. Optionally, in the Print Comment field, enter comments you want to display on the printed seating chart. In the Desk Size and Color area, you can complete any of the following options. In the Desk Color drop-down list, select the color you would like for the default desk design. In the Font Color drop-down list, select the color you would like for any text that displays on each desk. Select the Show Desk Comments checkbox to display comments on a student's desk by default. Select the Show Student Picture checkbox to display the student's picture on each desk. Select the Show Daily Attendance checkbox to display the daily attendance code for each student on each desk. In the Attendance area, select one or both of the following checkboxes. Allow Daily Attendance and Allow Period Attendance. When you select these in the Daily Attendance view and the Period Attendance view, you can select an attendance code from the drop-down list on each desk. Click Save. You can now add desks to the seating chart. You can add them manually using the Add Desk button or on the Desk Arrangement panel that displays, select whether to format the layout by column or by row, and then enter the number of desks you want to display across or down. Then you can choose the order for assigning desks using one of the options in the drop-down list. To add all the students' desks to the seating chart, in the Add Students section, select the checkbox to add all the students to the chart, then click Arrange Desks. Once you've added desks, you can move them around or add labels. Be sure you have unlocked the screen using the Edit button. Then, use the cursor to grab desks to move them around. Click Add Label to add labels to the chart. For example, to add the teacher's desk location or an exit for the classroom. To enter attendance on the seating chart, select the Daily Attendance or Period Attendance radio button depending on which type of attendance you want to take and which type you selected during setup. Drop down list display on each student's desk and you can use these to select the appropriate attendance code for each student. Any layout or attendance changes you make on the new seating chart save automatically. In the display view, you can click print to print the seating chart.